Hey friends, in this tutorial I will show you guys how to encrypt text using the Caesar cipher. So let's get started. Now the thing is that I want this tutorial to be very quick. I have already created the script and this tutorial is for kind of intermediate and advanced Python users. But if you're a beginner level, you don't understand anything that I explain in here, don't worry, I've already created a five part tutorial series on Caesar cipher that is on my channel. In that tutorial series, I have explained uh, this line by line with lots of examples so if you don't understand it don't worry just watch those and you will understand it so what i do in here is that uh, i create this variable called alphabets and this holds all the alphabets in the english language then this variable a string input what it does is that it holds whatever the user types in so it prompts the user for an input so whatever the user types it will be stored in this variable then i ask the user for a key and then this n variable it holds the link of the a string a string that the user types this variable that I'm creating a string output it's empty that's why because uh, that's empty because I'm using it in here in the for loop now in the for loop what I do is that I'm creating a for loop in the range of n so n is the length of the passage that the user enters the first variable that I'm creating in here is the character and this is a string input and it what it does is that it identifies the string sorry the characters and the message that the user types so let's print character let's comment this out in here let's run this and for the message let's type in so instead of hello let's just type ma academy and for the key let's say tree so what it does is that it shows me ma academy you can see that line by line uh, sorry each character is separated as uh, shown on uh, on a new line after that what i do is that i create this variable called location and i'm saying alphabets dot find the character so what you do is that you find this character in here that's m a uh, then a c all this in the alphabets in here that i'm creating i've created so let's print it so let's say print character and then also location let's run this so enter your message m a academy sorry i forgot to enter the enter button so let's say ma academy tree so notice that this time what it does is that it, uh, the first one was the one uh, was the character that we see this identifies the locations of it so you can see that m is a 12 character in here so if you start from zero then this m character in here it is the 12th character now uh, a is zero a in here is one but in index, it, uh, what it does is that it treats it as zero. In, py in programming languages, indexing starts at zero. We humans, we count at one, but the indexing starts at zero in computers. That's why it shows zero in here. So it, what it does is that it shows me all those characters in here, all the numbers of those strings or the locations in here, in the alphabets. After that, what I do is that, so in here, I'm saying the new location. So in here, let's print the character the location and the new location let's run this let's type ma academy for the key let's type your tree so now this first two you can see you i explained it and the last one what it does is that it adds a tree to it so what it does uh, 12 becomes 15 0 becomes 3 uh, this 12 becomes 15 24 becomes 1 why because 24 it's then 25 and then 0 and then 1 because we cannot have more than 26 characters so what it does is that it modules it is modulus in here uh, it shows us the remainder of it so 20, uh, 25 sorry 24 becomes 25 and then it becomes 0 and then 1 and the last one in here let me show this so in here the string output let's run this type ma academy and for the key a set tree so you can see that this is how ma academy is shown when it has been encrypted using the caesar cipher so what it does is that it adds a tree to this line now let's type ma academy and for the key let's type one two three one two three notice that it has encrypted it using 120,123 so it has shifted it using this many characters or this many numbers 
so this is it for this tutorial guys uh, if you have any questions any suggestions or recommendations feel free to put it in the comment section below and if you found this tutorial useful make sure to share it with your friends and i'll see you guys in the next one